Welcome to 411 Carline. You can find us at 411carline.com. You can give us a call 952-540-9000 to set up an appointment. You're welcome to view the free car facts available on our website at 411carline.com. Um, we do prefer appointments as well, so please make one of those either on our website or by giving us a call. Generally, giving us a call is the easier way. We have this 2008 Toyota 4Runner. It's an SR5 with the moonroof. It's above average as far as condition goes for the year and the miles. Um, it does uh, have a couple things you need to take care of yet. Of course, it's got a ding in the back right there. It's kind of an odd one too. Big, heavy basketball. No, I'm just kidding. Who knows what that was from, but. It's been fully inspected by a third party mechanic shop. Uh, this one got brand new uh, front brake pads and rotors. Also got calipers on the front. Um, I'm trying to remember, I think we did rear pads and rotors on this one. No, I think it was just the fronts. Rears were good. Tires were good. Pretty common tires on these Bridgestone dealers. Tread depth is good yet. Paint condition, so it's uh, overall pretty good. I don't see a ton of rock chips. Uh, there's a couple here and there you can see on the hood. And then there's spots from... Uh, it was just that detail almost got in rain down or something, so. Headlights are pretty clear for a forerunner. Got the fog lamps. The wheels do have a little bit of the uh, standard Toyota corrosion. They had that problem from 2000, like, I don't know, mid 2000s to about 2009, I think. Like I said, it's got the moonroof with the roof rack. Paint's pretty clean though, actually. There's a little scuff right down there, a little scratch there. It's a pretty specific color, so I don't really have any touch up in this color. It's got the trailer hitch tow package. Also came with this factory spoiler there. Let's see, yeah, that one's got a little bit of the standard Toyota corrosion. Couple of little nicks low on that door, but overall the paint's in definitely above average condition for the year and miles. Show you the interior here. Looks pretty good. Doesn't smell like a smoker vehicle. door bottoms there. Nice and clean. Have the seat folded down. There we got the seat folded back. Decent. Pop the boot here. So yeah, plenty of space back there. It's got the cargo mat. Cup holders here in the center. Or not cup holders, armrests. There is cup holders. There are cup holders that come out of that. Yeah, pretty clean. This one's not, uh, I forgot to look where this one is from, my brother bought it, but uh, it's not rust free by any means, but it's decently clean compared to most. You can see it on the underside here. You can see it's got uh, just a little bit of starting on the pinches. Oop. 
wish my phone would lighten up. I think it lost that setting or something like that. As you can see, definitely better than a Minnesota vehicle, but... This one has 142, 194 for miles. Um, has volume controls here, cruise control, headlights with fog lamps, factory radio. This one does have an AUX port. It's in the center console here. Can't really see it because it's kind of dark in here. You can kind of see the outline of it. it. Has automatic climate control, which is the temp right there. Some people like to use the fan speeds. I always like to just find a temp and hit auto and it does it on its own. I guess maybe because I drive vehicles that don't do that. Um, four wheel drive. Window works as it should. This is for hill descent. You'll probably never use it. It's for uh, off-roading, but if anyone's ever wondering what that is. Moonroof's clean along the edge here. It's always something to look for on 4Runners. see what else on the inside here. Factory manuals in there. Yeah, it looks pretty good. Pop the hood. It actually is pretty clean underneath here. Usually you got some rust in like this general area here too. Um, this one obviously has surface on the uh, on the bolts and then on the uh, hose clamps, but it's not uncommon. Insulation is pretty clean. And you usually look up in here too. Um, oftentimes these are really rusty. This one looks like it's pretty clean. Like I said, it's definitely not rust free, but it's uh, cleaner than your average Toyota that's been in any winter conditions. Hopefully you could hear that. The motor's kind of loud. My phone picks up a small engine noise. Didn't make an appointment. 952 540 Thanks for your time. Have a great day.